Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the film or video editing series. In this video, we will see how to use the speech to text feature in Filmora 11. I'm using Filmora 11 and we are going to convert the audio file into the text file. So if you have any narration or if you have any voiceover, you can convert that voiceover into text. In the previous video, I have shown you how to convert the text into the speech. Now we are going to convert the speech into the text from voiceover to the text file. Now here is a dummy video that I'm going to use and here you will see the voiceover file or the speech that I want to convert into the text. So let me play the audio first, the speech voiceover first. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel for upcoming free videos on WordPress website, Elementor tutorials, WooCommerce, so this is the speech that I'm going to convert into text. Click on the file that you want to convert into text, highlight it, and here you will see the option speech to text. Automatic conversion of video and audio files with audio to SRT subtitle files. These will be subtitles. Now here I have a video and an audio in separate file. Now you may have a video along with the audio recording. So it is not necessary that the audio file should be separate. You may have a recording on the video itself in a single video file. So you can use that also. So here I'm using this audio file and when I highlight this audio file, I can see the speech to text. Here I have another video file which has the voiceover. So I can select that file and I can use this speech to text for that video also. So I'm going to delete this one and I'm going to select this audio file. You can also right click on the audio or video file and you will see that option speech to text. So I'm going to click on speech to text. Now here you will see different language of the audio to be transcribed. So what is the language of your audio or the video file? So you will need to select that language. If your voiceover is in German, then you will need to select German. If it is in French, then you will need to select French, Japanese, Chinese. So there are different options. So you will need to select the proper option according to the voiceover language. Here the voiceover is in English. So I'm going to select English US. Now it is asking me select the file to be converted, the entire timeline or the clip selection. I have selected this audio file. So I'm going to select clip selection. Now transcriptions are automatically matched to the timeline. So you can check this one so that it will be matched with the timeline which according to this audio file or the video file. So click on OK and it is going to convert the speech into text. It's going to take some time. All right, so the file has been created. Now here you will see that time remaining is 1782 seconds. So that means the speech to text is not completely free. So you will get 30 minutes speech to text. After that, you will need to buy the subscription. Let me click on it. And here you will see the plan for speech to text starting with $4.99 per month. And here you will get one hour STD. Here you will get five hours. Here you will get 10 hours, $29.99 per month. 16 languages so you can see the other features of this subscription so i'm not going to buy it so let's close this one and here you will see the speech to text so this is the file that that has been created automatically now let me play the video and you will see the subtitles here which are generated automatically do not forget to subscribe to quick tips youtube channel for upcoming free videos on wordpress website elementor tutorials woocommerce search engine optimization, social media marketing, video editing tips and more. It is converted properly. If you want to change the format or the font or the style settings of this text to speech of these subtitles, then you can simply double click on it and it will open in a new window. From here, you can change the position of these subtitles on the timeline. If you want to increase the time, you can also increase the time. This is how you can increase the time and it will get adjusted automatically. So these are the time codes. Now let's see preset. So if you want to change the text font, you can change the text font from here. Double click on it, select that text block and double click on it and it will change the font. These are the presets that you can use. If you want to change 
the size you can also change the size if you want to select all of them you can select all of them and i'm going to change the size here you can also make it bold italic here you can see that apply to all you can select this one and it will get applied to all the timeline now click ok and you will see the change in the font here let me play it again do not forget to subscribe to quick tips youtube channel for upcoming free videos on wordpress website elementor tutorials woocommerce <laughs> all right so this is how you can use the speech to text in filmora 11. so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comments section. And press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching Quick Tips.